Hi, and welcome to Brems to Puzzles, and back to the World Puzzle Federation 2016 Round 1, which are puzzles created by puzzle creators from the Netherlands. This is the last classic Sudoku in the series, or in this set, um, and this is created by Richard Stolk, and this is a 39-point classic Sudoku, so I'm expecting this one to be a step up in difficulty. So um, let's jump straight into it. Of course, there'll be a link below in the description to this puzzle, as well as to the entire World Puzzle Federation archive. Let's have a look at the rules and let's get straight into it. So normal Sudoku rules apply. So in every box, in every row, and in every column, the digits one to nine must be placed without repetition. That's it. I'm going to restart the puzzle to restart my timer. 39 points. This one should be interesting. Let's give this a shot. So... Um, do I want to look at the quadruples in this row? Like, is this a naked single? It sees two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is one or eight. Um, because there's a lot of digits filled in some of these rows and columns. So what do I need to put in this row? I need to put one, two, three. I've got four, uh, one, two, three, and eight. And this can't be three. Well, this can't be two or three. So this is also one or eight. So this is a two, three pair. Can I repeat that anywhere else? So what am I missing in this column? It's one, I've got two, three, one, seven, eight, nine, and there's no seven or nine here. So this is one or eight, and this is a seven, nine pair. And the nine here makes this the seven and this the nine. Okay, so what about this quadruple now? One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. And there's a six or a seven here. So this is four or eight. Four, six, seven, eight. There's no four here. There's no eight or six here. This is four or seven. Mm, not sure. And in this column, I've got one, two, three, four. So it's five, six, seven, eight. There's no five or seven here. So this is six or eight. So these are five, six, seven, eight. There's no eight here. There's no six or eight here. Oh, it wasn't quite as much as I'd hoped. I did get this nine and this seven. Eight, eight. Well, that's just making this eight. Which means this is six, which takes six out of both of those. One, one, no, I've already got the one. Nine in this box has to be in one of those two by pointing, which puts nine in one of those two. Seven, not quite. Ah, nine is here by pointing because of the two nines looking into the box. Seven is now in one of those two by pointing. Eight is in one of those two by pointing. So what about this quadruple? Three, five, seven, and nine. So this is three or five because it's C seven nine. So these are three, five, seven, nine. That one can't be three. That's getting close, isn't it? And in this column, one, two, three, five, six. So this is only two or three, giving me a two, three pair in the box. But these are two, three, five, six. There's no three or two here or six. This is a five. I can take five out of both of those. I can take two out of here. I can take three out of here. That's an interesting two, three pair. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. These are four and nine. Wow, there's these hidden pairs all over these. Okay. So four and nine come out. Now I've got, uh, no, it's not quite. Hang on, this is five, seven. Is that true? So this is eight, which makes that four, which makes that seven, which makes that six. Seven says there's no seven there. Seven is in one of those two by Sudoku. And now we're seven in this row. It has to be in one of those two, making this the five and this the seven. This is brilliant. 
five comes out of those, so uh, it's not quite enough. This triple is one, four, five, and there's no five in those. That's the five. This is a one, four pair. This triple is one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, eight. There's no eight at the top. Eight is in one of those two. So these are all one, two, three, four. So three is in one of those two. There's no one in them. So they're just two, three, four. And there's no four there because of the four, nine looking down. So now get a two, three pair as well. So this is a triple. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So these are only from five, six, seven. So this is five or six. And these are five, six, seven. And this one can't be a five because of the five already in the row. Oh, this one has been doing something for ages. This is eight. This is one. This is eight. Put one in one of those two, but the one four is looking up, making this a one in the corner. So this triple maybe? One, two, three, four, four seven, and nine. There's no seven at the top here. So seven is in one of those two. So this is two, three, four, because two, three, four, nine for the row, but there's already a nine in the box. So one, two, three, four, five, there's a six in one of those two. And this six is looking up saying not there, that the six. This is two, three, four looking down saying that's not the two. So these are one, seven and eight. And I can't put, oh, I could put one there. So this is seven, eight. This is one seven because it can't be eight. One four. So these are two three seven nine. So this is three seven nine, giving me a three seven nine in this box with that not being able to be a seven. So one two three four five six seven eight nine. So these are just four and six, and the four is looking across, making that the six and that the four. The six looks back, making that the seven. That's not the seven. So that's the eight. But if this isn't the seven, that removed the pencil mark of a seven. This isn't the eight. And this is now a triple. One, three, and five, which makes that the two. Now of that, this isn't the one. This is the one. This is the three, five. The five makes that the three and that the five. This isn't the one or the two. This is the eight. between this the one, which makes this the four and this the one. This is two, five, six in the row. So this is the three and this is the four. The three looks up making that the two and that the three, making that the three, looking down, making that the six, making that the five. The six looks down, making that the two, taking two out of there. I got this wrong somehow, but ah, it was the three, making that the five and that the six. This is really cool. The five takes the five out of there. What is this triple? Two, three, nine? Two, three, nine. Well, there's no three. Oh, the three just makes that the nine, that the two, and I can take the two out of there. And the nine means that's the three and that's the nine. Take the, which makes that the seven and that the three. The nine looks up making that the two, take the two out of those. And the nine also looks up making that the seven, that the nine. The nine looks back making that the four and that the nine. The four and the three look across making that the two. There's no two or three there. That's the four. And that is the solution to this quite difficult classic Sudoku. That was really, really cool. I like that one. Now, since I last recorded a World Puzzle Federation puzzle, it's been about a month and I've been doing a lot of creating um, puzzles using classic techniques. I'll be honest with you, I've started creating and recorded a bunch of Sudoku Tudes puzzles since I started. Um, I last solved a World Puzzle Federation puzzle. Does that mean I've got a little bit more skilled at solving these? Maybe, but um, it's, I've had a couple of months of Sudoku practice since I in, since the last, literally, between Classic Sudoku 5 and Classic Sudoku 6. So maybe I've gotten a bit better, but I really enjoyed that one. That was a lot of fun. Thank you to Richard Stolk. Um, I'm looking forward to doing more of these. Um, 
Let's see how these, this set continues. And as always, good luck with your solving.